But first, a desperate search continues for two missing people after their boat capsized off Stony Island in the Detroit River. That search tops our news here at noon. Thank you for joining us. I'm Evrod Kasimi. This is video from the scene as that search started late Sunday night. Police say a boater from Ontario witnessed that boat capsize and they were able to help rescue most of the passengers, but there still are two adults that are missing, a man in his 50s and another man in his 60s. Both the United States and Canadian authorities are searching the Detroit River right now. Let's get out to our Victor Williams. He joins us with a closer look at that search. Victor, any luck so far? Yeah, well, the search continues for those two men right here on the Detroit River. Take a look behind me. You can see all the search boats that are out here looking for of these two. Now, we're told originally there were nine people aboard this boat when it capsized, even children on board, but thankfully there was a boater from Ontario nearby able to see all of this as it was happening. That boater then decided to get as many people onto his boat as he could. Unfortunately, those two people, however, that they're searching for right now were left inside of the water. We're told that it's 52-year-old Robert Childs along with the 66 year old father Rooney now we're told that this father is the priest of a church in Trenton so obviously a lot of people are concerned right now at this moment we're gonna also get you out to footage from sky 4 that shows everything from a bird's eye view and you can even see all the water that these guys are going to have to cover to find these two men but something else we want you guys to also see if you take a look right over here at this boathouse that is believed to be the boathouse of one of the men that they're looking for mr. Robert and right now they're operating out of it, hoping to find these two men as soon as possible. Reporting out here, Victor Williams, Local 4.